Hey, in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to clear CMOS on ASRock B550 Steel Engine. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. Clearing the CMOS on this particular model typically involves a couple methods. So I'm gonna give you the main method that is intended to be used with this specific motherboard and alternative ones. So this motherboard has a specific pin that you need to use in order to clear the CMOS. You can use alternative methods, but I'm going to talk about this one first. So as you can see, there are two pins, and you will need to short these pins in order to clear the CMOS for this particular board. This is referred to in the manual, so if you would like to follow that along, just grab the manual as well, and it is located here, so at the bottom right corner of the board. So you will have to remove this shield from the board, and after it is removed, at the left side of the debug lights, or the debug codes that you can see here, you will be able to find clear CMOS, so these two pins right here. As I've said before, the main way to clear the CMOS for this particular model is going to be to short these pins. Before start, first completely power off your computer and unplug the power cord, so make sure that you unplug everything. Next you will be able to discharge the residual power. With the computer powered off and unplugged, press and hold the power button for 10 to 15 seconds. This will discharge the residual power in your power supply. And with that done, you can short these pins using a screwdriver. So you will either be able to use a screwdriver to short these pins like so, or if you have this jumper piece, you can put it on the top there like this. So, if it is a jumper, move the jumper from its default position to clear the CMOS for about 5 to 10 seconds, and if it is pins, you will need to short these two pins. And afterwards, you can reconnect the power cord and reset your PC. An alternative method to do this is going to be to remove the CMOS battery. So, if you don't like this method or it doesn't work, locate the CMOS battery, remove it, and then wait about 5 to 10 minutes. So, it is going to take a while. After this time has passed, you can reinstall the CMOS battery and reconnect the power cord and power on your computer. I hope I was able to help you on how to clear CMOS ASRock B550 Steel Legend. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching!